scientifically proven ways to get thicker hair. Thin or thinning hair is a widespread condition. Both women and men may experience thin hair in their lifetime. It could be caused by natural aging, genetics, and poor nutrition. No matter what the cause, it may be possible to help hair look naturally thicker. Let's go over 8 natural ways to thicken hair. Number 1. Skip the sulfate shampoos. When it comes to thicker hair, sulfates are not your friend. This strong cleansers might give shampoos that sutsy quality, and even give the illusion of volume in the short term, they can contribute to damage over time. Sulfates can irritate the skin, dry out strands, and cause inflammation by disrupting the scalp's microbiome. These factors can cause increased shedding and breakage for some, especially those with naturally dry strands, curls, and coils. Staying clear of sulfates in shampoo is always a good call. These aggressive lathering agents can dry the hair out and strip color and natural oils. Number 2. Don't overdo dry shampoo. Not washing your hair every day can help keep your strands conditioned. However, always reaching for dry shampoo can do the opposite. Overuse of dry shampoo is not only cheating your scalp out of a TLC it needs, but it can also cause detrimental buildup on the scalp and suffocate follicles, which can lead to thinning hair and hair loss. And when it's time to wash, don't skip on that second shampoo and scrub it as you mean it. You may even consider a scalp exfoliator to help remove buildup. Number 3. Give your scalp some love. When it comes to thicker hair, it's not just your locks that need attention. Dry skin on your scalp or product buildup can choke out the follicle, reducing the diameter of the hair growing out, and in some cases reducing the follicle's ability to produce hair at all. We suggest a scalp scrub or scalp massager to help turn over dead skin cells and stimulate blood flow to the hair follicle. Another proven way is to give yourself a relaxing scalp massage. Just 4 minutes a day has been shown to increase hair thickness. Even better, add peppermint oil to the mix. Animal research has found that this essential oil can actually increase the number of hair follicles when applied topically. Number 4. Put the heat styling on low. Are you guilty of blasting your hair with hot hair dryers, curling wands, and straightening tools? High heat styling habits are another major culprit and can essentially strip away the outside cuticle layer of the hair or burn it, rendering it incapable of holding body or wave. Another defense is to safeguard your hair before you straighten it with a nourishing heat protection spray such as a bit of plain old argan oil. Number 5. Skip the overly restrictive diets. Not getting enough nutrients or the right nutrients can affect both hair growth and fullness. That's why it's important to eat a range of healthy foods, such as nuts, seeds, fruits, vegetables, lean protein, and healthy fats. Your body needs adequate nutrients to support healthy hair. If you're only eating the same few foods and cutting out a lot, you're setting yourself up for being deficient in certain nutrients. So it's important to get enough right nutrients for proper hair growth. Number 6. Think beyond protein. Protein is a key macronutrient in overall hair health. In fact, hair consists mainly of protein, and research shows not getting enough can mean thinning hair. Just like you should eat a variety of nutrients, getting a mix of proteins can help build healthier hair. In addition to consuming the usual protein-rich foods, oysters and pumpkin seeds deliver zinc, salmon, and sardines are rich in omega-3 fatty acids, and eggs contain biotin, nutrients that have all been linked to hair health or growth. Number 7. Don't forget vitamin C. Vitamin C-rich foods can act as a healthy ager for the scalp. Not only can the antioxidant protect hair follicles from free radical damage, which research shows can sabotage hair growth and thickness, but it can encourage full hair. Vitamin C plays a really big role in collagen production and that helps strengthen hair. Citrus isn't the only super source of vitamin C, though, Brussels sprouts, broccoli, red pepper, kale, strawberries, and kiwi also deliver. Number 8. Consider supplement. Yes, there are hair supplements out there that promise all kinds of amazing things, but do they deliver? If you are deficient in minerals or certain vitamins involved in hair growth, it could be beneficial to work with a dietitian to get you on a supplement routine. One supplement that may hold promise for hair growth is biotin and collagen, both of which are packed with amino acids. 
it's not something that will have instantaneous effects, but considering collagen's numerous full-body benefits and minimal side effects, it may be worth adding to your supplement rotation. Low levels of biotin have been linked to hair loss, and other studies show that taking these supplements does support increased hair growth in women in a double-blind, placebo-controlled study. Getting thick hair is all about healthy choices, like sticking to natural products, eating healthy, taking supplements, and being kind to your strands. So hopefully you got some value out of this video. Thanks for watching and I will see everyone in another video.